Okay, so you're gonna need some scissors. You can even see this. Scissors. I have really small hands, so um, yeah. Okay. Well, first of all, you're going to want to um. I forget how I did this. <laughs> okay. So you're gonna want to go to the bottom and cut this part off. Like this. So you go right here and you just go in and cut the tape. That way it's easier to get to. Then you do that on every single side. Like this one will do it. <laughs> It might do the, it might accidentally cut the plastic, or you might accidentally do it, um, that's okay, because I'm not going to use the plastic, or whatever this is, and then you take this off, like, oh, hold on, this side, you got to make sure every single side, and you're not really going to, sorry about that, you're not really going to use the plastic, unless you want to use it for like something different. Um, then you take the plastic off. You just like take it off, and then you're gonna wanna take your amazing hamster out. As you can see. Okay, sorry about that. That was kind of like weird. Okay, but yeah, you're gonna wanna cut this thing right here to get your amazing hamster out of that, and then you wanna. You're gonna wanna try. Okay. So once you get your maiden hamster out, you're gonna slide that in the hole if you can. You're gonna get it out soon. Okay. So then, once you do that, you're going to go right here where there's a little open space. It's near the top, and then you're going to want to, yeah, I say going to want to, but, um, you're going to, you're going to get the tape off right there. So, yeah. Okay, so you get the tape off, then you go on this side, and as you can see, this comes out sometimes anyways. So then you're going to... Put the tape off on this side too. And it's already, like, mine kind of got ripped right there, but whatever. And then you're just gonna pop this open and, like, rip that sort of. And then cut this off if you ripped it, anyways. You can tape it back on. That's what I'm gonna do. Yeah. Okay. And then you have a Webkins. Maiden hamster bed. Or you can use it for Zuzu Pets too. So yeah. And then let me get my tape. Okay, so I got my tape. And hold on a minute. Then I'm just gonna tape this part. Right there. And then get another piece of tape. And you're gonna just take that. Like that. And if you have two maiden hamsters, it's easier to do it with one maiden hamster here. Let me get my zoo clip. Well, is it pretty much you just do this. You just get your maiden hamster, then you do zoo pet, and then your maiden hamster. So yeah. But I only have three maiden hamsters. So and it also works. I think it might work for some webkins, like littlekins. I don't know. Let me check. Oh, littlekins, littlekins. Okay, oh. littlekins. I got the littlekins pug. Well, it kind of works for littlekins. Not very well, though. But, yeah. It works better for maiden hamsters. So that's kind of what I made it for. So, yeah. And then you can get, like, a sock to put 
around it, like for a cover. So yeah, so that's how you make it. And I hope you enjoyed this video because I've been wanting to make this for a long time. And I finally got another amazing hamster so I can show you guys how to make it. So yeah, so I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope you make it. So yeah, thanks. Oh, and for this, you can actually use it like for the plastic part. You can use it like, I don't really know what you can use it for, but like you can just put your amazing hamster in there or like a cage. So yeah. And